Hey, my peeps, walking down the truth with Marcy Locke. This is my beautiful girl <laughs> in Colombia, Elena. Eliana. Eliana. <laughs> Eliana. See, I'm still learning to, to speak it all awesomely. And we're, we're actually in this beautiful park she brought me to that's close to the apartments where we're staying for the next couple days. Tomorrow, we get to go to the school in Colombia that I, the kids are on my mindset program, and she went, you graduated from there. Yeah. She was there for five years, and I just wanted to share because. Okay, this is how I roll. You guys all know this. I only attract the most amazing people. So my whole team, we've got like a team of like five, six people yeah. here from Columbia plus my team here. They're picking up peas from the airport. They're grabbing groceries. They're getting the apartments ready. And what do I get to do? I get to hang out with this lovely chick. And she took me walking all around the city and we went to a good food. And oh my good gosh, amazing <laughs> food. And, and I want you guys to hear the awesomeness that she's up to and what she's been able to do. So coming from she she graduated from the school and now she's you know you've been able to live in Russia and Turkey and visit yeah. Iran and she works for the embassy and yeah. does all these things she's written a book she got asked to come back here to Colombia to be award given this award for this book she's gone and lived on a mountain and been a yogi and it's like of course I'm like of course I only experience the most amazing people yeah so what would you say is like you know you having the experience you had where you know you said when you went to Iran they're like you're a woman and all these yeah, things yeah, yeah. and experiencing what you've been able to experience what would you tell people is uh, possible for them or what you would really want to share with them uh, I want to share that it's possible to do whatever you want whatever you feel and when you want to do something just do it just do it yeah <laughs> well because we have the power inside to do it yeah and if, if we have one dream or something it's it's only yeah, two. I, I love her. <laughs> oh my gosh, she showed me this whole video. She got attacked by an eagle, and it was a big ass bitch. It was like this big. It was huge. And what we what was cool is, is we got talking. We were talking about a lot of like she's she's in her zone of excellence. So she's like she's working for the ministry. She's gets the embassy sends her everywhere. She's deciding if she's going to go to Montreal now. She lived in Russia for two years. She was all over, and and doing this thing where it's like always showing up and serving in such a great degree. But are you totally happy? And she was like, I was feeling when you came like there was this energy I needed and something. And I'm like, this is why we got to hang yeah. out today. We got to have some awesomeness and talk about <laughs> how she gets to totally live in this alignment of not only sharing the genius that she's good at, but getting into art and back to yoga yeah, and yeah. really honoring her body and doing all these things that allows her to be this full great amazing light because yeah. you're such a beautiful light like she shared so much with me today so um, you know obviously like this this beautiful place that we're at yeah. in Columbia oh, this is, has a lot of energy yeah and the breeze uh, and the everything and the people and it's a really good place and that's what I would love to touch base on is the fact that here like I had a lot of people be like oh my gosh you're going to Columbia <gasps> mercy no. be safe mm -hmm. right and I was like what are you talking about? Like, I'm always safe. Like, of course, I mean, I'm set up. I have my teams that are here to, to intercede us. And the like, risk is only that you want to stay more time here. Yeah, the I, only like, risk. I, like my experience <laughs> of Columbia has been awesome. And like, you know, the people, beautiful and awesome. And again, this comes back to the belief systems and where she even went to Iran and like, everyone's like, oh my gosh, what are you doing? And she's like, it was like, people were so friendly and so nice. And when you shift what you're looking for and what your experiences of the world, that's what you find. I remember when I was in LA for some filming mm -hmm. and I walked through this part of LA to go uh, for the filming and they were like oh my gosh you walked through that part of LA and I was like what like I walked down the street and I literally had guys like they're like you are beautiful and like everyone was so nice and friendly so again are you keeping yourself from experiencing life because of the stories and the parameters that you've given yourself we were talking about all these places in the world where you like it's so safe and it was so awesome yeah. and then society or the media has maybe created this idea of like oh, if you travel or you do this you're gonna be unsafe well guess what we're safe we're safe. Yeah, we're safe. <laughs> <laughs> and we're just locking it down and having a good time. So she's going to take me back around uh, the park. We're going to get to the apartments and, and kind of settle in before all the peeps get in. So I just wanted to share this beautiful face with you and this amazing woman and what she's up to, like doing such big things and coming from this space to be able to do all these great, amazing things. You can too. Anything else you want to add to that? No, that's okay. Power of choice is yours. Choose your best life. Lock it down. And I'm not married. <laughs>